Okay, you just got the Sony WH-1000XM6, so let's get them connected and fast. In this video, we'll walk you through how to pair with Android, iOS, and even a Windows PC. If your WH-1000XM6 are brand new out of the box, well, just power them on, and they'll automatically enter into pairing mode. You'll hear... Pairing. And a prompt should appear instantly on most Android phones thanks to Google Fast Pair. But if you've already paired them with another device, just hold the power button for about five seconds or until you hear Pairing. again. Now on your Android phone, go to settings, connections, or connected devices, then tap Bluetooth. Turn it on if it's off and select pair new device or add device. This will enable it to start scanning. Menus may look slightly different depending on phone brand or Android version, but the steps are mostly the same. Select WH-1000X M6 from the list and you're connected. You'll hear and you're ready to go. On an iOS device, head to settings, then Bluetooth and make sure it's turned on. Then scroll down and look for other devices. Now hold the power button on the headphones for about five seconds until you hear Pairing. and then WH-1000XM6 should appear on the list. Tap it to connect You'll hear the confirmation tone and you're ready to go. To pair with a PC, go to settings, Bluetooth and devices, then click add device. Once again, hold down the power button until they enter pairing mode. When WH-1000XM6 appears, click connect. And here's a pro tip for you. If you're running Windows 10 or Windows 11 with Swift Pair enabled, you might even see a pop-up notification as soon as your headphones are nearby and in pairing mode. Just click connect to finish the process all in one step. Once paired, your headphones will auto reconnect to the last device. Now, if you want more control, make sure to download the Sony Sound Connect app for custom EQ, auto noise canceling controls, and firmware updates. Now you're connected and ready to enjoy the best noise canceling headphones. Thanks for watching.